Four years ago, a severe headache changed Shanae Pitts' life forever. They told me that they didn't think she was going to live. She was suffering from a condition where her autonomic nervous system didn't work properly and an intense attack of swelling in her brain and spinal cord that eventually put her in a coma. Initially, when she came in, she was nothing like what you see today. She was unable to take care of herself at all. With the help of teams at Acuity Specialty Hospital in Atlantic City and Jefferson Health, she was able to regain some of those skills. Which, you know, entails learning how to walk, learning how to talk, learning how to do ADLs, all kinds of things that now she has to do therapy to get back. And today she wanted to simply say thank you. I probably wouldn't be where I am today because mostly everybody in this room helped me because mostly everybody in this room played a part in my life because before I got therapy, I really could do anything. They saved her, they, and they're giving her inspiration every day to get up to look forward to coming to therapy. Along with saying thank you, she was able to show those therapists just how much their hard work has helped her get to where she is today. When you see where she came from, you know, not able to take even one or two steps and not being able to stay with inside the walker, and now she's walking a functional distance in the clinic um, independently. It's, it's, it's really emotional. I, c I could cry right now. It was, it was beautiful. And you know, you don't always get to see your patients and what happens to them after they leave you. So it was a wonderful experience. She's come a long way, but her journey isn't over just yet. I'm getting stronger and better. I'm, I'm getting more in, trying to get more independent with walking and doing my daily living, doing stuff for more for myself. And each day I'm trying to get better. And she plans to do it with the help of the therapists that have helped her so much already. I'm Kimberly Carr for SNJ Today.